Every day we meet new people, people who are strangers. Sometimes we meet them with our parents or our teachers or with other adults. But sometimes we meet them when we're alone. Most of these strangers are nice people, but there are some who are not. And therefore we have rules about how to meet strangers when we are alone. This is Terry, and she's on her way home from school. On the way home, Terry always stops at this store, even if it's only to window shop. Terry's parents have told her never to take money or candy from strangers. Terry remembers and politely says, no thank you. Terry's friend, the sales girl, wonders who the stranger is that is talking to her. When the stranger offers to take Terry home in his car, she remembers what her parents and teachers have told her. Never take rides with persons you don't know and always get the license number of the car of any stranger who asks you to go with him and try to remember his description. Then tell your parents or your teacher about it. Some children attempted to try to get home sooner by hitching rides. But a wise boy knows never to take a ride from a person he doesn't know. He may even have an accident if he's a bad driver. If you ever see any of your friends doing this, remind them of the danger. If they still go, take down the license number of the car. Remember to walk straight home from school. Always take the same safe route, the one your parents know and have told you to take. Your parents know just how long it will take you and will worry if you're late. Avoid shortcuts through alleys and empty side streets. Freddy's dog got away from him and ran into a strange deserted place. And of course, he's worried and wants to go in after him. to go in after him, but he remembers in time. His parents have told him never to go into a strange, isolated place alone, so before going any further, he returns home to ask his father to help him find his dog. Yes, there he is. Freddy found his dog the right way with one of his parents along. He remembered that he must never go to or play in a strange or deserted place alone. Even though you may know never to take anything from strangers or go with them, there are some children who are too small to know the right thing to do. If you see any of your friends about to make a mistake, you can help. It is important never to take anything from a stranger or to go with a stranger anywhere, even if he seems to know you or tells you that your parents sent him to pick you up. If you don't know the person, don't go with him. When you are in the park, always play in the areas that are set aside as playgrounds, not in bushes like this, or in culverts, caves, old shacks, or places like that. 
and never hang around or play where the restrooms are. Everyone knows that the playgrounds are the most fun. Here is a girl being asked directions by a stranger. She knows what to do. Politely, the girl gives the man the information and points the way. But when the stranger asks her to go with him and show him the way, she, of course, refuses. If strangers ask directions, be polite and tell them. But never go with them to show them the way, even if they ask. Sometimes you may meet a lot of strangers. At Halloween, for example, if you go out for trick or treat. But don't go out alone. Go with a friend or two. It's more fun that way and stay in your own neighborhood. You may be out selling Girl Scout cookies or collecting papers for a paper drive. Whatever the reason, it is important to remember never to go into a stranger's home even if you are invited. It is always a good idea if you are out calling on people to have a grown-up take you and wait for you. When you go to the movies, you will be among a lot of strangers. It's a good idea when you go to the theater, always to go with some friends if an adult cannot go with you. If you have to go alone, sit among other children. Now let us see what we have learned about how to act with strangers. Never take anything from a stranger. Never go anywhere with a stranger. Get the license number of the car of any stranger who asks you to go with him. And remember his description. Never take a ride with a stranger. After school, go directly home. Always take the same safe route and no shortcuts through alleys or empty side streets. Never go alone or play in strange or deserted places. In the park, play in the areas set aside as playgrounds not in the bushes or near the restrooms. If a stranger asks directions, be polite and tell him if you know. But it's important never to go anywhere with a stranger. When you are out meeting a lot of strangers, be with friends or have a grown-up accompany you. Never go into any stranger's home even if you are invited. If you go to the movies without an adult, always sit with your friends or among other children. Those who know and love you will be proud that you remember and follow these rules each and every day. Mm -hmm.